Well, you may be cute, but they stink. Well, so would you if you was running about in a field all day. Right, and I'm not going to start cooking again until I've had a shower, OK? You're not used to this proper work, are you? Yeah, don't get used to me helping you either. I'm far too refined for manual labour, Andy. <laughs> yeah, but you like a bit of ruffle, don't you? Uh, Andy, get lost. You smell worse than me. <laughs> well, maybe we're both near the shower, then. But I'm shattered, OK? Can we not wait? Yeah, whatever. Well, I suppose we are saving up from now on. Sorry? And if we're going to start economising, then it seems a bit wasteful having two showers, eh? Purely money-saving exercise. Well, we may as well start somewhere. Oh, hiya. I, we were wondering where you were. I thought you'd gone out. You all right? We thought we'd get back to stuffing in, didn't we? Why are you here, Rob? Sit the kettle while we get dressed, eh? Come on. Hey. Rob, what am I supposed to do? Apologise for going to bed with my own husband. You're in love with me, not him. Oh, Rob, stop making it harder than it already is. And I'm in love with you. How many times do I have to say it before you start listening? You're not going to let this go, are you? Is that what you want? Is that what you want? This is what you want. Oh, Rob, it's only getting changed. Well, I'll take what I can get. And I don't just want some kind of affair. I want you. From now on, all the time. <gasps> Ooh, something smells good! I mean it. Just in time, Donna. Says I've Rob playing Gooseberry all night. Oh. 